never asked for, but I'm here, and here we go. <laughs> the last bit of cleanup from last night's game. That's, that's the end of last night's game right there. All right, let's talk mound. What do you guys do on a daily basis to make sure it's ready? Today started last night after the game. We started cleaning the mound from last night's game. We packed in new clay where they take off and land. Today's more of a... Uh, Final smoothing on the mound, packing in, tightening it up. They want it very tight for the landing zones. Uh, and then clean up, and just gonna, if you just, you just finish the cleanup part of it. And we're gonna go back and do a little bit of light water and, and then reconditioning it for, today, for today's game. I like that reconditioning. When you see rain in the forecast, are you like, not today, not feeling it? That's a lot of extra work keeping that mound okay. Like rain is not during the games. <laughs> That's it's just fair. not during the games. Okay, let's so, talk next steps. What do we do next? So, next, so, so we've cleaned up the mound, we've got in, in the home plate area, so. I think you said you want to do a little bit of mowing. You did some mowing earlier on the inside. Yeah. Maybe we'll go to the outfield here. It's a little different machine. Now, maybe, maybe easier for you. I don't know that I aced the first machine. And you know what? My parents own a lawn and landscape company, so they're sitting at home like this right now. We've taught you better, Mayor. We've taught you better. Are you sure you want to fix the mistakes I'm about to, to no, make? No, okay. You got it. I got all the faith in the world in you. All right. So get yourself up on the machine and get yourself comfortable. Lewis, take it from here. Right before you get into the one check, lift your wheels up, up with this right here, pulling it back. So if you put it down right here, it goes down. Okay. Pull it back. It okay. So right and before then you go onto the one check, down to cut. you don't have once oh, okay. once this is up. If you put the wheels down, the Just wheels will spin. If you bring it up, the wheels will automatically stop. Okay. Now what happens when this becomes a runaway train? Is there like a boop? Okay. Let's give this a whirl. Football. She in the turnaround. Uh-oh. Wrong way. She went right instead of left, but she'll do a circle. She'll get it. <laughs> there she comes. She's doing real good. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Not the straightest of lines, but hey. Kind of got it. It's a little... Something ran out in front of me is what happened. The cat from a couple years ago, ran, I don't know if you saw it, it darted out. I had a swerve, I wasn't about to run over the cat. So that's why the lines just maybe aren't as straight as they should be. All right, they're working on the infield dirt right now. So exactly what does that machine do? That's our infield groomer. It's got these really fine teeth on it that we're using to lightly harrow the, the infield skin in different directions. So once we cross it multiple directions, then we're actually gonna follow up with hand rakes and close those little grooves as best we can, try to make it all one again. And the cleats go in at night, so they make little holes and depressions in the, in the skin. So we're trying to cut the clay up so we can actually refill those holes back in. What are the optimal conditions where you have to do the least amount of work to the field? We like humidity on the dirt because it holds moisture. The infield is like the moisture. It keeps the ball down, it becomes more of a playable, consistent ball hop. So you'll see us using moisture and lack of wind and you know cloud cover works out well for us so it doesn't evaporate as fast. That'd be more optimal. Uh, a little warmer than it is right now, but uh, it's chilly yeah, right now it's early in the morning. A little but windy right now. We're going to work. We're going to work. All right, we'll cover this up. <laughs> okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. I did nothing but make it work. All right, Danny, be honest with me. I'm honest. <laughs> On a scale of one to 10, 10 being the best, one being the worst, where do I rank? Eight. 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 I have Eight a future plus. in this? You got a future in this. <sighs> and, you know, and you're always in the building. And whenever it rains, I know I just look over and you could possibly get to that 10. If you ever get need there. help with that tarp, I think that's the next step for me. You, you did excellent. With this worked in the wind, you, you mastered it. So it was a pleasure. Thank you so much. Okay. And you know what? They now have to fix all my mistakes. As kind as he was with the eight ranking, I think I'm going to stick to broadcasting for now.